So, okay, this is assignment four, digital Im and immersive XR prototyping. So I'm showing you here some ass assets I first assembled. These are the actors in my experience. This is a botanical garden experience. And you can see in the upper right, I have an equirectangular 360 photo of a botanical garden. And in the lower right, I have a 3D model of a plant. And my goal was to develop an experience that had both of these kinds of assets. That was probably too ambitious for this exercise. But let me show you what I did. First thing I did was in Apple Reality Composer, where I developed <clears throat> An experience. I'm actually going to go ahead and play this. So you can see that I've, this is the beginning of the experience where you would start with these, this ability to na navigate to different parts of the garden. And I just did one interaction here where if I click on the globe for North America, it will bring up the plant, um, the crimson pitcher plant with a little bit of information here and the ability to go back home. And these were just the default Apple Reality Composer um, interactions. So then I wanted to see if I could do something. So this was a more of an AR experience using a 3D model that I had developed. And then I wanted to see if I could do something with my 360 photos. So this is uh, actually a kind of more of a digital prototype that I developed in Adobe XD. I'd heard about this Draft XR plugin that might be, you know, kind of like um, A-Frame, that I'd be able to develop a, a digital prototype and then view it in VR. The plugin didn't really work. I don't think it's being kept up to date with browser changes. But you can see here, if I go ahead and play this, we started a similar screen where we've got three globes, and there's actually a 360 photo of the botanical garden behind that. Uh, if we click on North America, we can see uh, uh, some information about a coast redwood tree here. If we were in VR, we could actually stare up into the branches of this tree. Uh, if we click on home, we go back here, and I added one more 360 photo of a princess flower here growing outside my house. Um, and if we were in VR, we could get nice and close to it. So I kind of like those interactions, <clears throat> but um, it's not really um, uh, a full VR prototype, but you get the idea.